first things first, we'll have to find a way to, to contact the police and then move her body. Okay, stop, 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 stop. stop. Just hold on, hold on to your invitation card. Alright, it's okay, stop crying. Alright? It's okay. <laughs> They had this very unholy agreement to end it all together. So in the world beyond, they can continue as lovers. But the poison had no effect on Joyce because he had drank the waters of her Kalishishe before drinking the poison that she served him. I'm shocked to hear this. So we still have such things in our tradition and people abandon it and die from poisons? Okay, so you the kind of The more you live, the more you stand the chance of understanding the mysteries of life. Like I told you, Mirabel lived a very evil, very evil life. And the ghost of Mirabel is what is haunting your friend now. She wants him to kill somebody so that he will be killed himself. And when he dies, he will join her and both of them will continue with that their evil agreement. That's what she wants. Abomination. It came more like uh, the strong man of Nandu. There must be a way around this. Of course. There is always a way around everything. This is absolutely redeemable. But the question begging for an answer is Will your friend accept to be here before me? Considering what is happening to him right now. He will only be a fool not to listen to these revelations. Then let him come. Because we must have to spiritually severe the relationship he has with Mirabel. So that that urge to murder somebody that she deposited inside of him will be quenched permanently. He came more like Even if he doesn't want to come here, I will personally drag him here myself. Thank you so much. At least we have dictated what the problem is. Let us bother about the solution now. I'd like more. You say, go well. Thank you. It is here to be. It is a book. When I do, when I walk under the snow, you would wear more noble. Why do we have men in families and they will allow their young ones to be going astray? Is it that men are no longer men or that men do not want to do their jobs as men? Listen, Johnson, you cannot be dismissing me like this when you know we have serious issue on ground. Ike Moneke has pinned your problem to Mirabel, and you must listen. Mirabel. Did you say Mirabel? Yes. He told me emphatically that you had dealings with her before she joined the Great Beyond. Oh, Lord. How is that possible? I mean, I never mentioned my dealings with Mirabel with anyone. How did he know? Yes. You never mentioned it to anyone, but men who are wired into the ancient by the gift from the gods can see everything. So please, calmly start telling me everything between you and this Mirabel. Well, there is nothing more to tell. I mean, you know everything, don't you? You do? Uh, they've told you everything already. Mirabel is, is, is a lady that I, that I had dealings with. But she lived a very wayward and careless life and, and killed herself in the process, you know? Johnson, a woman who is paying for her evil deed lured you into dying with her and you agreed 
I mean, what, what were you thinking? What made you do that? I was never going to do it. What, what, what do you think? That I was going to kill myself? Oh no. You know, I... Listen, man, you know the life of a man. Sometimes, you know, life can be a certain way. I wanted the money at the time, so I chose to play a fast one on her. Now, you know, it's, it's backfiring. Now listen, the acceptance of dying with her made her take that poison. She was believing she was dying with you. So the fact that you did not eventually die is why her ghosts are all over you. Ha. This one is hard though. So what are we going to do now? Am I going to live the rest of my life like this with a ghost hovering all around me? No, 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 no. Look, think of something. But Dibia is out of it. I'm not, I'm not going to stand in front of a Dibia. What do we do? Johnson, as it is now, you have no choice. And she will kill you if you do nothing. <sighs> what does this say? What is it? Ah, I cannot kill myself. I cannot kill myself for Mirabel. I cannot kill myself. Ah, I cannot kill myself for, 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 for a crime that I did not commit. Eh? Now, Kuchi has come here now to come and tell me that, oh, it is Mirabel. Mirabel, Mirabel. So what? Eh? So what? So what? I'm supposed to, 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 to pay for a crime that I did not commit. Mbakwao, it did not happen. I'm not going to pay for a crime that I did not commit. Mirabel, you should leave me alone. Leave me alone. Ah, what is it? Mirabel, you are dead. Stay with the dead. The dead and the living have no business whatsoever. Let the living stay with the living, just like those of us that are here. And let the dead bury the dead and remain with the dead. We have two separate destinies. And what is it? Now they want me to pass him on the deep doctor. For what? You have no destiny, Johnson. I am your destiny. You lost your destiny the day you gave me your word and I gave you my money. <laughs> that's her voice, huh? that, 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 That's her voice. Hmm? Hey! Hey! That was my voice, Johnson. And this is me. Why have you refused to let me rest? Please don't kill me, brother. I beg you, please don't, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't, don't, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. I, 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 I'm, I'm sorry for everything that, 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 that I said. I, I, I'm just saying that, that it, it has been six long years now, please. And I've not had peace since you died. You know, man, let me have some peace. I beg you. I beg you. This, this body, this body, this body, this body, six years now. Please just let it go. Please let me have some peace, please. Please, I beg you. Please, I beg you, please. Please. Huh? Oh, stop asking useless questions, for you know all the answers. You must come with me. We had an agreement, and I stand firmly on that agreement. You're trying to play smart, can no water down that agreement. I cannot come with you. I cannot come with you. I, I, I have a life. I, I have a life. I cannot, I cannot kill my... Look, Mirabel, let me tell you, let me tell you the truth. You are a spirit. This is what I want to say now. You are a spirit. Go and investigate it. Go and investigate it. No, where I come from. It's an abomination for anybody to kill themselves. I tell you, whether you're a man or you're a woman, you're a spirit. I, I, I'm going to wait here. Go and check and come back. I tell, I, I, I'm telling you the truth. I cannot kill myself. I, I cannot kill myself. Please. hell with that useless abomination of yours. You must come with me, Johnson. I gave you 60 million naira of my money. And I bought you the day I wired you that money. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Please. please, 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 please don't, 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 don't make me take my life for a crime that I did not commit now. Please. Please. This money you're talking about does not even belong to you. It belongs, it belongs to one man, Sylvester, that you have something to do with. Eh? Eh? Even as a spirit, tell yourself the truth. Tell yourself the truth. You are not a good person when you were here. You were committing all school kinds of crimes. Eh? You didn't even tell me that you were a bitch and you were dating me. You, you, you went to prostitution. You were collecting money from other people. And, and now you want to come and uh, 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 scare me to, to pay for crime that, 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 that I did not commit. Don't do this now. Uh, please. Uh. The, the, the money. Uh. Uh. Huh? 
Și asta s-a pierdut. Hei! Și asta s-a pierdut. Bă, mă, și-l sapie? Și-l sapie, da? Și mă, de sapie? Pentru că și-l oază, dar telling the truth. Aha! Aha, vreau, tu cum a fost mult, tu pe făi cai, dar ai de loc, even in the spirit world, where you are. Don't you even judge something. Judge it there. Acum, tell me I was wrong. Aha? Not wrong. Wait, she's going to come back again. Hey, my bill does not rest, though. When she comes back now, what am I going to do? When you came back to the village, you did not tell me all this. You only told me your friends were envious of you and uh, you were afraid they might want to poison you to death. That's true, Uncle. But that's also because I didn't know how it would sound. You know, that's why I hid it from you. So, six years. Six good years after her spirit has been haunting you and now wants to end up your life, you come back to me. Uncle, the truth is that I need your help. Her spirit has just been tormenting me. Will not even let me settle down with any woman. I don't even have my own, I don't even have a, my own seed. I, don't, I am not ready to die now. I need your help, Uncle, please. Well, I know of one man. He came more naked. The strong man of Nando. He is, to the very best of my knowledge, the only man that can solve this problem. They said he came more naked of Nando. You know him? Yes, my friend told me about him. As a matter of fact, Uncle, he's the one that made this shocking revelation of, of her. Good. Let that same friend of yours take you to him. He will solve this problem, provided you do whatever he asks you to do. Okay, Uncle. That is it. I purposely asked both of you to come here today, being a care market day, because it was on an care market day that she killed herself. Justin, you offended her spirit. Yes, the agreement was that both of you should die together. You're not supposed to be alive. Um, I, I, I was not part of her sins in, uh, when she was alive. You know, we had a relationship quite all right, but her money was not the reason I fell in love with her. You know, I, I saw her light and we fell in love with each other, not knowing that she had ruined her life with surgery and criminality and then when it was time for her to take her life, she wanted me to come with her. Why are you bringing logic into this now? The offer was made to you and you accepted. You gave her your account and she wired the money. Yes, uh, because at that, at that point in my life, things were tough and I wasn't thinking straight. That money is the link she has to you. And um, for us to dismantle the connection, you are going to return that money. How, how do I... I mean, I... Where do I take the money? To the owner, of course. I don't know him. I don't. I don't. I don't know him. I know that the man's name is Sylvester. You know, and, and at the point she wanted to get this money off him, she she drugged the man and, and made away with, with 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 his money. I don't know where to trace it. Find him. Then, in that case, you will have to return the whole of that money. To an orphanage home. You have to find an orphanage home and return the whole of that money. When you have done that, I can then proceed to shame her. 
But the question begging for an answer, Johnson, is are you ready to return that money? <clears throat> okay, morning again. My friend is not a greedy person. We don't touch what does not belong to us. Are you ready to do this and free yourself from this bondage? Yes, I will return the money. Okay, we'll return the money. I'm not going anywhere for your end has come. You are not going anywhere for your end has come. I don't know who you are. Please, I'm not part of this in any way. I am not. Same here. I, I know nothing about this, please. anything with anybody. Who is that lady? Who is the other lady? And why was she running away from her? Human beings and the spirits may trade on the same market, but it is established that they do not trade together. Human beings trade with human beings, and the spirits trade with spirits when human beings are gone. By the verdict of this ABK, you evil woman, I summon you to come here Day so that we can iron this thing out once and for all. I have no business with you and you must stay off my lane. You have no lane, you useless woman. And you must have to be very careful the kind of things you say before me before you provoke me to trigger your second death. Do not tell me about second death. Well, I have not even died. We had an agreement and that was why I wired my money to him. I will only die the day he dies with me. You cannot stand before me and lay claim of ownership of that money because the money was never your money in the first place. That money belongs to the fool who foolishly lost his money. And the Johnson has returned the whole of that money to the motherless baby's home in line with my instructions. What are you intending to achieve? You are separated from that young man. And I'm ordering you here now to stay away from him and allow him to marry the woman of his dreams. No! No! I am the woman of his dreams and he must remain with me. I would never allow him go to those women. And that is it. You are separated from that young man. For you have no business in his part. Like I said originally, human beings and the spirits do not trade together. 
You are dead, for you killed yourself. And you have no portion in the life of that young man. By this mark, I cut off every relationship you have with him. And he is completely free from you. No. He is, he is going to marry the woman who will raise children from him. No. And by this mark, no. he is very free. Very free from you. Ow. No! See Johnson. I was coming here hoping I'll just look around and see the woman you tend to marry. Ah, did that thing. Guy, yeah, I'm still scared. You said, should I say the ghost of Mirabel or Mirabel herself? Because I, I don't understand what that girl has done. Has worried me to a point, eh? Where I cannot even think of a woman in this house. I'm still scared. You don't blame me. What are you talking about? What am I not talking about? A man like Ike Moneke told you that you are free. That the ghost of, of Mirabe has been banished uh, from appearing to you to trigger whatever idea into your head and you're still scared? Uh, okay, 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 okay. I can't be I'm mad. I'm still scared. I'm, a, I'm, I'm human. I'm still scared. I'm still scared. Maybe the fear will wear, out, wear off after some time, but for now, I wish to have a woman here, but... Um, oh boy. Relax. <laughs> you won't understand. Uh, Okay, fine. Yeah. Tell me the truth. Yeah. Among all those ladies, all those women you've had something to do with. Yes. Who do you love most? Ah, Debbie. Come on. Like if you're asked to marry now, who Ooh, do you want to marry? Debbie. That girl is everything. What? Not only is she beautiful, she is very sacrificial, and then she believes in. Or should I say she believed in us? You know. She put on hold the relationship she had with the guy in Europe just because she, she saw a future with me. Nah, that I wouldn't forget. No, it's Debbie. If I have a do-over, Debbie, all the way. So thumbs up for Debbie? You're settling for Debbie? No, no, come on, that's in the past. <laughs> How? What, what do you mean? Well, that's in the past. I, have, no, I can't reconnect with Debbie. I mean, it's, 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 it's not possible. I mean, when she left, she left. She never came back. And that's because I made, a, I made an attempt on her life. Unlike Quincy, who still tries to keep in touch once in a while. But Debbie just <laughs> left and never looked back. But I can understand. I wasn't, I wasn't good to her. So the point you're trying to make now is that you're settling for Quincy? Come on, I gotta stop now. Don't change the atmosphere here. How? Quincy, how? First off, Quincy looks everything like Mirabel height, shape, body size. And then Quincy is fake. Everything about her is almost fake. Her boobs fake. Uh, she has gone to do her body, remove one or two, to add one or two. Her bum fake. It would interest you to know that one of my cleaners, uh, you know, showed me a piece of paper. I opened it. It was um, a receipt of a vaginal treatment. That I'm what? telling you that Quincy had gone for while she was here. So I'm not going to marry a woman who will take me to all the prayer houses in this town because she's looking for fruit of the womb, as they put it. You know, uh, Quincy and I expired goods. So, uh, leave her. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Um, so what you're trying to tell me now is, or rather what I'm going to tell you now is that you are settling for Debbie. If miracles happen. Of course the miracle will happen. Yeah. So it's Debbie. Debbie all the way. I tap into Listen, your faith. Uh, you, you are seeing Debbie tomorrow. How? Anything you say now will be a no to me. You must see Debbie tomorrow. Fingers crossed. You are seeing Debbie tomorrow. Fingers crossed. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Johnson, what are you doing here? Debbie, please. I'm sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing, you know, but please, I've come to 
ask for your forgiveness and understanding. Please. So you think I'm going to listen to your tales right now? For God's sakes, Johnson, you have a spiritual problem. You need to fix it. And yes, I have solved it. You've got to believe me. I'm a free man now. Okay? All that demonic and negative or just coming from the ghost of my ex-girlfriend who who wanted to spiritually manipulate me into either killing myself or killing someone and then end up in jail. But I'm, but I'm free. I have been delivered from all of that. All of that struggle and all of, of that manipulation set me back. Because she, she never wanted me to be with someone else. She didn't, she didn't want me to have a life of my own. But having gotten my spiritual freedom, the only woman that I cannot get out of my mind is you, Debbie. Debbie, I love you. Debbie. Debbie. I've come here to ask that you forgive me, but I've also come to ask that you agree to be my wife. Debbie, if you marry me, I'm going to make you happy. Baby, you made a lot of sacrifices just to be with me. You loved me like no other. You believed in us. Give me a chance to show you the new me, baby. Please. Will you marry me? Just to keep 